This is the Bacardi bottling plant in Jacksonville, Florida. It's August 16th, 2012 at 4.30 p.m. What you're seeing here is a palletizer, a machine that packs and stacks cases of rum onto a pallet. The man you see here operates the palletizer. He's been cleaning the machine because bottles often break in the cases and the rum leaks on the conveyor belt, making it sticky. When this happens, the cases then crash into each other and bottles fall to the ground. This has been happening for a couple of years at Bacardi and it hasn't been fixed. As the operator walks away, cases start coming down the line very quickly and crashing into each other. He hits the emergency stop button. Now what's supposed to happen next is operators need to put a lock on the machine to prevent somebody from pushing the start button while someone else is inside. Under the machine, there's a lot of shattered glass as seen in these photos. There's also another emergency stop button and some bars that you can put underneath the platform to keep it from falling. But employees rarely did this for fear of slowing down production. The man in the orange vest is Dave Davis. He's a temp worker on his first day on any job in his entire life. In fact, his shift started just an hour and a half ago when he sent this photo to his fiance. The operator points down below and tells Davis to sweep up the glass under the machine. Look at the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. You'll see Davis go underneath the palletizer to sweep up the glass. A few minutes later, Davis goes back upstairs to ask a question. The man in the white shirt, who's a supervisor, told police he had told Davis to sit by the side, but others heard him tell Davis to simply go get some gloves. Davis goes back downstairs underneath the machine. The supervisor and operator finish cleaning the conveyor rollers above Davis. They close the gate and turn on the machine. Cases come down the line, they're pushed into a square, and the platform goes down. Then they hear a yell. They see that Davis has been crushed by the machine. They hit the stop button. The palletizer operator is trying to manually raise the platform off Davis, but it's not working. The supervisor radios for someone to call 911. Here you'll see a worker pass down a pry bar to see if they can lift up the platform. There were some 60 cases weighing about 2,000 pounds on the platform when it went down. First responders got there within minutes, but it was already too late. The weight of the machine had killed Davis.